We were trying to get through to Nash all day. My friend called me and he was like, bro, like, Nash is dead. And bro, instantly, like, man just broke down in the middle of the restaurant. Everyone was done, like, we went outside, couldn't even breathe, like. We've all met up later, and I couldn't get out of the car. Like, I was with critical, like, I, I couldn't get out of the car. I was like, it, it hit me heavy. Like, it just seemed so surreal. Like, I was literally just speaking to him about the future. What do you, what do you mean, like? Me and Nash, we met um, first year of college, and he became one of my closest friends. He was hilarious, so funny, witty didn't take nothing seriously, turned a negative into a positive of the way he fought. Like, he was just an amazing character, man. He helped us start the restaurant. Like, he, he came to us and was like, yo, like, let's do something, in it. Like, I want to be involved. So he was going to be the manager of the restaurant, the head honcho, and yeah, basically, he was going to run it. Yeah, and then, obviously, when we was about to launch, and I remember we hugged, he was like, bro, we done it. Like, we finally done it like after a year and a whatever it was that it took us to do it, it was like we, we're here now we're about to launch like he was so excited about it the next day he took his own life it was crazy man like like it's like it broke man's heart like man's brethren's gone and get me so i just wanted like if only if i knew only if we could have stopped it only if we could have stopped it if i just spoke to him if i just went there and met him if i it's always the if i do you know what i mean so it was a shock, man. He was literally just having a conversation about the future and he took his own life. It was like, what? So there was like that initial, I'm confused. Like, why? Like, cause that's the question that it's gonna bug me for the rest of my life. Like, why did he do that? Why? What made you feel like you had to end your life? Do you get me? You always have to remember like, bro, Nash would have been here. Like, Nash didn't get to see this. Nash didn't get to see that. Nash, like, that's what goes through your mind when this is all happening. So we would have been celebrating together and he's not here. So your, the happiness always gets like knocked down by the sadness of him not being here. So it's like, you're always in a mad limbo in between. Like, it, it just makes me f know that like mentally, your, what your mental state can make you do, it's not even you. Like, it can take you into such a dark place that you it will make you do anything. Yeah, because, like, you don't know what no one's going through and how they're dealing with it. Everyone's got different breaking points. It's, it's, it is overwhelming, because, like, we've got a painting of, bro, like, why that's all happening, like, in the restaurant. You know what I mean? And we're all trying to make it happen, but at the same time, our friend's dead. There's no one on this earth that I would put it past now. I always think, making sure uh, make sure they're okay even if they seem fine even if they're laughing double check make sure they're all right like you never know what someone's going through do you know what i mean I, and he was a prime example of people masking their reality do you know what i mean or how they're feeling and he done that so well because nobody was the wiser like none of us had an inkling that he was going through anything like none of us so for me, like everybody that I speak to, I'm like, are you all right? And a lot of the time it's like, oh, are you all right? And it's like, yeah, I'm good, you? And it's like, nah, bro, are you all right? Like, are you all right? Yeah, it goes a long way, man. In terms of like getting through it, the pain always eases, time heals all. Well, so the pain will ease. Obviously, you just have to find a way to think about the people that have, have passed in a positive way, in a happy way, and trying to celebrate their life, you know what I mean? If they could talk to you now, they'll probably tell you to just make them proud, you know what I mean? So I feel like that's what you gotta do for anybody that's passed or gone through trauma. You just gotta make the person that's passed proud, man.